One of the episodes, like this one, like really creeped me out. Um, I forgot it was somebody. One of your patients had I don't know how to pronounce it. It's like epidermia dysplasia. Yeah, I was like, how can people like? Is that like how does how does that even happen? That's what I really want to know. Cause I was like, yo, I have never seen nothing like that. It's a literal genetic anomaly. It is not something that you see every day. I had to do a lot of research in order to figure out how to even treat this guy. There's only so many doctors in the world who's actually ever seen it and treated it. So in that respect, I'm super fortunate and blessed that I could be one of those doctors now. Um, but at the same time, it's it's super shocking. Like I I remember seeing it for the first time when I got the email and I just literally, I literally like jumped back. Like, what am I looking at, you know? Um, so, I mean, it's, it's a rare genetic condition where your body just doesn't turn off the suppression to create more warts. So in your body and my body, my body's like, nope, we're turning that off. In his body, it's like on full speed. So he just overgrowths all these warts, all these tumors. And so they're going to consistently grow because he doesn't have the off switch. Um, but he let it get out of control. Like you can cut them off like every now and again or freeze them or, or burn them off every now and again. But um, his has been growing since he was like seven years old. So oh. it looked like that. Is it like, is it curable? Unfortunately, no, it's not. It's not curable. It's, it's, it's able to be maintained. You can definitely maintain that condition, but you have to really be diligent, really develop a good relationship with a local doctor who can like take them off as they arise as opposed to just letting them accumulate. Like the surgery that I did on him, it was really aggressive. It was like, we're gonna take as many of these things off as humanly possible. We're gonna heal you up. And then, you know, hopefully they don't grow back as bad, but when they do grow back, cause they will grow back, go back and get them frozen off as opposed to, you know, having to get more surgery in the, in the future, you know?